Throwing numbers like equations Trench talk when you jump up off the porch as a youngin and start posting on the block with the junkies and get it bouncing. What's good? What's good, man? We locked in, man. Look, man. Hey, look, look, look. Honor up, man. Honor up, G. Honor up. Dang Dash, man. Old Skino. Benny Siegel. We need to do the honor up part two, man. I need to be in it. Hey, look. Hey, look. Dang. Look. Wherever I got an audition at, man. I'm ready to read some lines and shit out this motherfucker, nigga. Honor up. We got to do honor up too, man. Um, hey, dang. Hey, dang. What I got to do, man? Where I got to pull up at, man? I got to pull up at L.A., New York, Harlem. Where the hell I got to go at to do my audition, man? You hear murder mook in that motherfucker? Listen, your boy being there, Charlie, man. I'm telling you, man, I'm ready for the road, man. If I ain't going to be on power with 50, <laughs> I'm about to be doing a BET special out this motherfucker pretty soon, nigga. She on some gangster shit. Give me Remy Ma or something, you know what I'm saying? Hey, Remy be killing it, though, man. I'm like, damn, I'm looking at Mary J. Irv. Hey, look. Hey, dang. Honor up, too, man. I know you talking about paid in full, too. Honor up, too, bro. Bring that shit back. Niggas was saying that shit won't hard. Cool. I what? Look, honor up. Look. Honor up. I be watching that shit back to back, back to back. I like the way he made honor up, bro. How he broke down shit. It was like on some motherfucking Spike Lee type shit. Hey, look, man, dang, what we doing, dang? El Skino, holla at dang, man. <laughs> I got to get in there, man. Hey, look, put beans in there. Squash all that bullshit. Put beans in that bitch. Hey, bring that honor up shit back, man. They got to bring up honor up too, bro. They, that, man, look, he probably already shooting that motherfucker. Hey, look, I need a little small bro. I'd be the pizza boy in that bitch. <laughs> that movie go hard, bro. We had Cam, Myrtle Moot, uh, Styles P., yeah, everybody in that shit. That shit was lit, bro. Like, man, look. And I'm a Norfolk guy, Virginia guy, man. That shit, that's my shit, though. Like, I'm telling you, bro. Like, Dane, one, one thing I said about Dane, Dane was able to put together a lot of great movies, bro. You think about the paid in full. Oh, uh, what's the joint we used to, uh, Kevin Hart joint? Oh, uh, this is gonna come to me, but the joint with Kevin Hart, Benny Siegel, Nori. That shit was a fucking classic, bro. That that was the raw Kevin Hart, though, man. That shit, man. They ain't made a lot of great movies, man, from the state property joints. You know what I mean? Damn, how I slipped my mind like that? That slipped my mind like a motherfucker, man. But, yeah, that was one of the classic joints with Stacey Dash and all of that. Like, they ain't been making a lot of hell of a good, good movies from back in the day. I even heard Kevin Hart talking about the shit one time, man. Kevin Hart was talking about the joint, how back in the day we had Charlie Murphy in that joint. Yo, they ain't put together a lot of great projects. They don't, and people don't give him his, the credit that he deserved, man. He's a hell of a dude when it comes to that movies and music and all of that. That's why I, I feel like Jay gave him his respect and his just due. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, man, bro, hey, look. Hey, old skin old man, I'm on your, I'm on your tail, bro. Hey, look, I'm going to tell you something, though, man. I remember a while back when I first got on YouTube and shit like that. I'm talking about, like, watching it. Cause I ain't know nothing about it. I ain't know nothing about the flip phones and none of that type of shit like that. Uh, honor up, yeah, paper soldiers. That's the junk I'm talking about. Yeah, the paper soldier joint with uh, yeah, Benny Siegel, Kevin Hart, Nori. Hey, look, that shit is a fucking classic, bro. When when motherfucking Kevin Hart dropped the money on the fucking floor, you talking to Stacey that yeah, I'm about to battle. What do you say you about to battle the joint? <laughs> Yo, it's been, it, man, it's so many motherfucking pieces out there movie, nigga. That shit was hard, G. Hey, look, man, I gotta be, look, man, dang, gotta link the fuck up. I don't give a fuck, nigga. <laughs> hey, dang, if you see this video, man, look, where well, I gotta audition that, man. <laughs> On the rock, nigga, we gotta get, man, they gotta bring that joint back, man. And my man, Old Skino, was in there <laughs> murking up some shit. <laughs> like, Old Skino say, man, he say he doing all the projects that he did with the state property joints and stuff like that, then being a part of the uh, the Honor Up joint. You know what I'm saying? Leave legacy for his kids to be able to see, you know what I mean? The projects that he worked on and stuff like that. Because you got to think about the first state property joint. I like the first one more because I felt like it was so raw. The second one was more commercial. It ain't really had that feel like the first one. That first one shit. That shit felt like, damn, nigga. Get down and lay down when the nigga smacked that nigga with the joint and then bleat hit the nigga up. Like, that shit was, yo, that right there, classic, bro. They ain't been able to put together a lot of great movies, being able to do the, the things with the artists and stuff. Like, I see him, um, he trying to do his own media things and stuff like that. Damn, on the, on, on, on the round page right now, he trying to do everything independent and do it on his own. For you. That, that's a boss mentality, bro. But yeah, old Skino, man. I remember watching them old videos from back in the days, man. 
and I would watch him do his video. He'd be mad at Beans. He was always mad at Beans, man. <laughs> you know, I'm a Benny Siegel fan to the core, man. That's my guy, man. Beans been put out some real passionate records and stuff like that. You know what I mean? But yeah, man, I feel like uh, Oskino, man, put me on to the YouTube shit. I was watching his video. I'm like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, okay, okay, that's what you got to do. And he just said, be real, be yourself. You know what I mean? Make your video, make your content. Some people going to like it. Some people ain't going to like it. You know what I mean? But like, like I told you, people like him, you sit around a nigga like Oskino and be rich. Like, you know what I'm saying? Have a lot of money because he a type of person. Like me, I soak in things. I'm real quiet, laid back. I soak in information. So when I like a person like Oskino or Dane, if I'm sitting around them niggas, oh man, I probably soaked in so much. I probably soaked in a hundred million dollar worth of game off of just sitting in the room with a nigga like that. Like I say, that's why people pay, make you pay for that type of shit because just a few minutes of their time can can land you onto a different placement. You know what I mean? As far as me like learning the YouTube thing and making my videos and just being me. You know what I mean? North of Virginia dude, you know what I'm saying? Tower of the Park game. But yeah, man, like I say, man, uh, yeah, I got, hey, look, I got to hit up 52, man, 50, <laughs> I probably, look, look, man, I'm going to get in one of these projects, why would I tell you, I'm going to be in one of these, either, yeah, I want to fuck with them Detroit boys too, boy, they making some noise out there too, but dang, honor up, what's up, we got to, no, I mean, where I got to read my lines at, <laughs> hey, look, honor up, man, you know what I'm saying, bad guy, I don't give a fuck, man, I got two minutes in that motherfucker, nigga, <laughs> I'm trying to get down with that honor up too. He probably already shot that motherfucker, but that shit was hard to me, bro. I remember when I first seen it, everybody could say, oh, that ain't that good. Oh, they ain't messed it up. Woot, woot. I was like, damn, I don't even want to watch it because the press and the people in the media kept saying the movie was whack and it ain't that good and this and that. So I was like, man, that shit probably garbage as hell. I said, I ain't going to watch that shit. Then I watched it. And I'm like, this shit, this shit all right. Like, this shit like that. Fuck with it. I fuck with the honor up shit. Niggas kept bad mouthing the shit. I thought it was garbage, this and that. Then I watch, I say, this shit hard. I fuck with it. <laughs> honor up. You know what I'm saying? Hey, look, dang, what's up, man? Old Skinner, what's up, man? You know what I'm saying? What's good, man? Dang, got, hey, look, we got, man, you got to put that script together, man. I know you're talking about paying the fool that honor up. You got to come back, man. That murder move, man, that shit was hard, G. That shit was hard. I ain't gonna lie. That shit was hard, G. But yeah, that's all I have to say about that, man. Love everybody out there, man. Hit that like, the subscribe button for me, man. Don't forget to donate to the page if you like supporting the content and stuff like that. Got a lot of great things in the description box that I'm working on. If you want to be a part of it, just go down there and check it out, man. Love everybody out there, man. Salute to all the good people that's working out there and striving to do great things. But yeah, man, I'm out, G. Good morning, good morning to everybody out there, man. Family and friends out there. If you're tired of your nine to five or you're trying to make some money outside your nine to five, email me at this address right here. I got a great, great and amazing opportunity for you. And I would love to help you and to bring some value to your life. Email me or inbox me so we can have a deeper and in-depth conversation about the opportunity that lies before you. If you're trying to make extra money outside your nine to five, or you're just tired of your nine to five and you're ready to move on and to become an owner, email me or inbox me and let's have that dope and amazing conversation. Blessings to all my friends and family out there, man. I love all of y'all. appreciate all y'all support. And I just love that y'all been giving me nothing but positive energy. Everybody, every friend, every family member, man, I thank y'all just for always believing in me. Bless. If you would like to support me, I have all natural products that you can use in your day to day products from household products, beauty products, weight loss products, even products that can help you focus and also relieve stress. And even if you're having problems with sleeping, I have all natural products that can help you with that. I also have products that can help and boost the immune system. You know right now we're going into that cold and flu season and you may need an immunity pack to boost that system up. And we got all natural products that can help with that. We also got products, cooling products and heating products that can help with pain from feet pain. Because I deal with that all the time being a diabetic. I deal with feet pain. So I have this cooling spray that helps relieve you of pain. And listen, guys, these all natural products is the best thing for you. You need to get away from the chemical things that we are normally using in a household. But now we can switch it up. Now that I got the website, I got it. I'm going to allow y'all to email me and get an exclusive look at the website and y'all could be able to purchase these things at your timely uh, period and enjoy. 
When you email me, I'm going to give you an exclusive look or all access at of the website. And you're going to be able to pick the products that best fit your lifestyle or what that you need right now from the immunity pack. Maybe some household products that you need that's all natural. Beauty products that you may need that's all natural. I'm going to give you an all access look when you email me. I want to build the relationship with you so we can be able to talk about the things that you may need in your life, the quality of of things that you may need within your life. And I want to give you the best quality and the best product that fits you within your lifestyle. And when we have this conversation, if you are diabetic or you have any type of issues, we want to be able to assist you in a natural sense and to be able to give you the things that will be productive within your lifestyle. So when you email me, we're going to have a great and amazing conversation and we're going to break down what it is that you need. And we're going to provide it for you on the website and we're going to put you right in that all assets pass situation so you'll be able to get what benefits you and your lifestyle and what you need right now. But thank you guys. And I appreciate all the support that y'all been giving me each and every time y'all watch the videos. And like I said before, email me and we're going to be able to hook you up with that all access pass. Thank you. Hey guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit that like button. And when you hit that notification bell, it will always let you know every time that I upload new content.